leave it. Please. No, right. I am furious now and do not call me Lise when I am furious at you. I really like him, really. Secretly. You are joking, of course. Listen, Joe's a very loyal friend. He's special. <laughs> The man is childish and, frankly, weird. I know that, but I feel the venom with which you even say his name is quite unnecessary. Ben, I am serious. I really don't want him here. Can't he stay at someone else's? Well, you will have him except me. Quite. It's just one night. He's no trouble. He's a good bloke. I suppose you're just as passionate about defending me. He told me the other day you were a top bird. Oh, Christ, the thought of having that sordid man's seal of approval fills me with nausea. I had to put up with Wendy. Wendy and her 10,000 lotions. I was waiting for this. Wendy settled in here. Wendy was blissfully happy on the sitting room floor. Wendy was mortified when she had to get off her fat ass and find alternative accommodation. The poor girl was terrified of you. You used to snort at her like a rhinoceros. She enjoyed getting under my feet. Eyeballing me while I was writing, poking her gruesome nose into my affairs. That nasal grunt that you do in order to show your utter contempt for another human being. You think other people don't notice it, don't you? You think it's your own private noise or an aside to camera, like that look you gave her every time she opened her mouth. I think under the circumstances. That rolling of the eyes. It's very obvious, you know, it's not just visible, but some imaginary audience that follows you around, nodding wildly in agreement, clapping. <laughs> it's just that she bored the pants off me. I mean, I could actually feel my pants peeling away from my anus every time she spoke. <laughs> and what is that vacant grin she's got fixed across her head? You know, that permanent plastic smile constantly showing us her gleaming teeth. Why? Why does she feel the need to do that? Huh? Why? What's Podge going to be so fucking happy about? We are going to be late. 